Hi there! I hope today is bright and happy for you guys. A few months ago, I went to the nail supply store and I picked up the super awesome nail tints that are usually applied over gel. You guys know that I'm very into acrylic, so after playing around with them, I found a way to apply them over acrylic. In today's video, I am going to teach you my own personal technique if you, like me, enjoy working with acrylic, so you can create super fun color combinations with a flawless finish. Are you ready? If so, let's go! The first thing I am going to do is apply a thin layer of white acrylic, leaving the layer as smooth as possible. The reason why the layer should be smooth is because the trick so that the marble effect with the inks works out, the acrylic must not be filed before applying the inks, or the product cracks and it does not spread on the nail properly. Before applying the inks, we must let the acrylic dry completely, otherwise this also prevents the product from spreading and working properly. After letting the acrylic dry completely, I am going to apply a few drops of ink, in this case less is more since a little goes a long way. For this tutorial, I chose a range of some of my favorite colors such as pink, blue and purple. Using a clean jar, a little bit of pure acetone, and a precision brush, I am going to apply tiny drops of acetone to some parts of the design to create a more texture optical illusion. Using a gold color stamping polish and the same precision brush, I am going to create a wavy line on the design to decorate it. After allowing the design to dry and before encapsulating with clear acrylic, I am going to apply a thin layer of hard gel to prevent the monomer from fading the inks with its chemical components. Then I am going to cure this layer under an LED lamp for 60 seconds. After the layer has cured, I am going to use a wipe moistened with 99% alcohol to remove the excess and then I am going to use a sandpaper block to create texture and thus prepare the snail for acrylic encapsulation. By creating texture, the adhesion of the acrylic to the gel is facilitated. Now, this nail is ready for acrylic encapsulation. After encapsulating, I am going to remove the excess using a hand file and an e-file machine with a fine carbide bit. After filing and removing impurities, I am going to give this nail a delicate touch by applying this beautiful Swarovski crystal in the middle, close to the cuticle area. To bring this design to life, I am going to apply a layer of gel top coat and cure it under an LED lamp for 60 seconds. The final touch, as always, is to apply a small amount of cuticle oil to nourish the area. And my loves, this is the final product. I hope you all enjoyed this video and as always, I'll see you next time. Before letting you go as usual, I wanted to leave you the following phrase. Wisdom makes one wise person more powerful than 10 rulers in a city. I love you with all my heart. God bless you guys. Mwah.